Hello everyone. In this video, we will guide you on how to configure limit reservable bandwidth in Windows 11 or 10 to increase download speeds. By default, Microsoft reserves the right to limit network bandwidth by 80% to accommodate system activities. However, you can change this setting if you need it. In Windows 11 or 10, you can speed up download speed up to 20%. Whether you are using the internet through Ethernet or over Wi-Fi, download and upload speeds are very important to your Windows PC's overall performance. If you frequently download or upload large files through the internet, there is a tweak to gain more performance. With the default configuration of Windows 11 and 10, as part of its quality assurance package, Microsoft reserves the right to limit network bandwidth by as much as 80% to accommodate system activities such as security updates and license checks. In everyday use of the internet, you may likely not even notice the slow internet, but when downloading large files, the limit may hit and tighten your PC's network performance. Using this video guide, you can limit or disable the default setting that allows Windows 11 and 10 to reserve your network bandwidth for its own purposes. Here is how to do it. How to configure the limit reservable bandwidth in Windows 11 or 10. To configure the limit reservable bandwidth policy in Windows 10 using Group Policy Editor, press and hold the Windows logo key, and then press the R key to open the Run command box. Then, type pedit.msc in the Run dialog and press Enter key on the keyboard. This will open Local Group Policy Editor. Now, expand Computer Configuration. Expand Administrative Templates. Expand Network. Expand QoS Packet Scheduler. In the right-hand pane of the QoS Packet Scheduler, Select the policy labeled Limit Reservable Bandwidth and double-click it to open the setting. Select the Enabled option. And change the default bandwidth limit of 80 to a smaller percentage or make it zero if you prefer to turn it off. Please note, if you want to restore default settings, just select the Disabled option. Now, click the Apply button. Then, click the OK button. Finally, reboot your computer to apply the changes. That's it. Let me know via comment how this video is. Do you like more videos like this? Subscribe to our channel, Garup Windows. Goodbye. See you in the next video.